Blossom Opry. We are not the Melfus brothers. We are the, uh, what are we brothers? I don't know what we are. We are the, uh, we haven't thought of a new name for our band, but, so we'll just go with the Orange Blossom Opry Band. How about that? That's good. How's everybody doing? Good. How many people uh, are here at the Orange Blossom Opry uh, for the first time? We always like to uh, find out our new folks, uh, front row guys there over here. It's always funny to see people that won't raise their hand, but people pointing, and they're, he is. So uh, he doesn't know where he is, or he just doesn't want to be acknowledged. We don't know. Anyway, welcome to all the new folks. Uh, the Malpas brothers are here, and what we thought we would do today is something a little bit. Hey, man, they're awesome. If you haven't seen them, they're awesome. Um, and uh, what we're going to do is, uh, because they're here, we thought we would uh, do some older country uh, music today. So um, <clears throat> real different stuff. I'll tell you about that in a second. But before we do, I want to introduce guys in the band. 
And uh, we'll get rolling, ladies and gentlemen. The guy playing fiddle with me, pedal steel guitar, and anything else he puts in his hand from the great state of Iowa. Say hello to Doug Stocker. One, two, three. <laughs> the gentleman back there playing the bass guitar comes from the great state of Virginia. He, too, has a resume a mile and a half long. Please say hello to Keith Horn, everybody. Keith! <laughs> The gentleman behind me sings a fine song and has also played with many, many of the big stars in the country. Please say hello from Apopka, Florida to Randy Nichols back there. The gentleman playing the guitar comes from the great state of New Mexico. He also sings a fine song. Say hello to Dave Hawkez. Our piano player this evening is uh, our piano player uh, almost every evening, uh, but he is again tonight from Dallas, Texas. He too sings a fine song. Say hello to Chris Cockburn, everybody. <laughs> Nathan Smith is our sound man back there, and uh, say hello to him. I can't see who's doing the video. Is it Captain Kirk doing the video? Kirk. Fast, Fast Eddie on lights, and Roger and Heather Byers, our owners, are here, and we're to thank God for them because we're all employed. I thought I'd tell you a little story, and I don't want to bore you with this too much, but I want to just give you a little country music lesson in country music. In the 40s and the 50s and into the 60s, <clears throat> country music, most of the guitar was played on a big, what they called a box guitar, big old thick guitars. And, and, they start, and everybody played Gibson guitars because they were the thing back in my dad's day. And you'll see the Malpas brothers play one of those guitars because they play a lot of that authentic music, and it's awesome. Somewhere uh, in the late 50s, around 1960s, <clears throat> this guy named Buck Owens uh, came around, and a guy named Leo Fender started building these guitars that were slab guitars, which is a guitar like this. <clears throat> and uh, uh, the story goes that Leo Fender went to Buck Owens and said, if you will play a Fender guitar instead of the Gibson guitar, I will make sure that you never have to pay for a guitar. So when I was a little boy growing up, I saw Buck Owens and I saw Don Rich <clears throat> playing Fender guitars exactly like this. All I wanted when I was in high school was a girlfriend. That didn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> but all I wanted was a, a, a Telecaster guitar. <clears throat> I bought this one when I was in 12th grade. And uh, the reason I wanted that Telecaster guitar is right here. You ready, boys? If we can make this. Kick. Here's another reason I bought that Telecaster.
way they were before Love's gonna live here again Love's gonna live here Love's gonna live here Love's gonna live here here again No more loneliness Only happiness Love's gonna live here again Love's gonna live here again I hear bees are humming And I know the day is coming Love's gonna live here again Love's gonna live here Love's gonna live here Love's gonna live here again No more loneliness Only happiness Love's gonna live here Thank you. Keith Horn, everybody. Man, if you're not a Buck Owens fan, don't talk to me. <laughs> Buck was the best. Um, well, another uh, guy that came along in that same time. Also, Buck Owens, guitar player. Did you? Uh, were you a Don Rich fan, right? Didn't you? Everybody, oh yes. Everybody wanted uh, a Telecaster guitar. Don Rich also played fiddle too, which I don't. But uh, anyway. <laughs> Well, we'll try a fiddle song. Uh, yep, ready. Yep. Three, four, one, two. I love you so much that I can't leave. You call me up and tell me that you love me And all my thoughts of evening do no good Cause you got me hard over mine Worried all the time Knowing you will always be the same You'll keep hurting me, I know And I just can't let you go And my heart won't let my love for you change But you call me up and tell me that you love me And I still think there's a chance for us yet Cause you got me hard over mine Worried all the time Knowing you will always be the same 
You'll keep hurting me, I know And I just can't let you go And my heart won't let my love for you change My heart won't let my love for you change My God, country music right there Chris Cockburn, everybody. So uh, some of us that have been in the music business a long time uh, was really a good friends. As a matter of fact, this little band I was in, this guy was real interested in our band and was very supportive of our band in the early days. His name was Irv Woolsey. Irv Woolsey, I just learned, I knew he passed away just a couple days ago. Irv Woolsey made every thing George Strait ever is and ever was. He was George managers. Uh, he fished him out of the... Um, out of bars in, in Texas and turned him into the superstar that he is. And I also heard that on the same day that George Strait's fiddle player passed away as well. So um, our condolences to that. But do you think there's a position open for me? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. Here's a, little right. Here's a little tribute. Um, man, if you guys don't love George Strait, uh, something wrong with you. Here's our tribute to George and all the boys. One, two, three. From San Antonio, everything that I got is just what I got on. <laughs> when the sun is high in that Texas sky, I'll be bugging at the county fair. Amarillo by morning, Amarillo I'll be. Took my saddle in Houston, broke my leg in Santa Fe. Lost my wife and a girlfriend somewhere along the way. I'm looking for a when they close that gate, and I hope that judge ain't blind. Amarillo by morning. Rillo's on my mind. Amarillo by morning, up from San Antonio. Everything that I got is just what I got on. Lord, I'm free. Amarillo by morning. Amarillo's where I'll be. Amarillo by morning. Amarillo's where I'll be. You know, back in the days in the early, when I was playing, you know, country from the 60s and 70s, and we did a lot of it in bars, <laughs> and, and they drink. We used to, when I was 11, <laughs> I, had to, I had a guy come up and say, here, here, here's a whiskey sour. Yeah, just like, <laughs> yeah. I didn't know what to do with that. But. What'd you do with it? I, I still got it. <laughs> So, and, but here are some ideas. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three. 
I went partying the other night I started drinking, got real tight And we was playing with all of our friends It felt so good, we had to play it again Hey, bartender Hey, bartender Hey, bartender Draw one, draw two, draw three more glasses of beer She was sitting down on the end I said, baby, can we be friends? You look as sweet as can be. Come on down and drink with me. Hey, bartender. Hey, bartender. Hey, bartender. Hey, bartender. Draw one, draw two, draw three more glasses of beer. Tell me about it, Bobby. Nichols on the drums and Keith Horn on the bass. Here's Davy. We was having so much fun. I didn't know it was half past one. Turned around to have one more. I looked at the clock and it was half past four. Head bartender, hey bartender, head bartender, hey bartender. Drop one, drop two, drop three more glasses of beer. Where the jukebox is playing everything, everybody was beginning to sing. That's when I heard somebody call. A last call. For Bartender, hey, hey look at him. Hey, bartender, hey, bartender, hey, bartender, hey, bartender, hey, bartender, hey, bartender. Hey, bartender. Draw one, draw two, draw three more glasses of beer. <laughs> I'm getting thirsty. I have to uh, say happy birthday to Lynn Howes. Is that how you say your name? Where's Where's Lynn Howes? Where? Over there. Lynn, there's six people around you raising your hand, but you're not. Where? Where's Lynn? She is standing. There you are, Lynn. And today is your birthday? It is? Well, thank you for uh, spending your, uh, your birthday with us here at the uh, Orange Blossom Opry. We're certainly uh, glad that you're here. We hope you have a good time. Uh, we, when you leave, remember that we didn't ask you how old you were, <laughs> right? That, any idea just offhand how much you weigh? <laughs> just kidding. All right, let me, uh, let me just uh, do this because my guitar's been sitting in tune because because we there it is because we care everybody okay so far okay well we're gonna go way way back here's one that's here's one that goes way back right is this in g uh -uh. g yeah what key g dog it doesn't matter we don't you don't care if we all play in the same key do you all right we're ready oh, From a jack to a king, from loneliness to a wedding ring, I played an ace and I won a queen that made me king of your heart. From a jack to a king, with no regret, I stacked the cards last night. And lady looked, played her hand just right Walked away with your heart For just a little while I thought that I might lose the game But just in time I saw The 
twinkle in your eyes From a jack to a cane From loneliness to a wedding ring I played an ace and I won a queen That made me king of your house Jack to a king From loneliness to a wedding ring I played an ace and I won a queen That made me king of your hall Dave Hawkins, everybody. Hey, man. That was awesome. Um, as you may know uh, or not, Keith played with uh, Ricky Van Shelton uh, for many years. He played bass for Ricky Van Shelton. <clears throat> and he said, old Dave sounds just like, just, just like old Ricky Van. <laughs> right before, no, never mind. Uh, what key is this song in? G George, J. Is this uh, your? Uh, no. Man, here's a, some just, I don't know how to say it any better. Here's just some country music. <laughs> Three. There's something wrong But I'm feeling about you That runs through my heart like a torch cuts through steel You haven't said a word Are you feeling it too? Is it cold in here? Or is it just you? Trying to hold you near You stare into space As if I was on here Did I love to stop? Is it just about to? Is it cold in here, or is it just you? Should I leave the door wide open, let the children kill that old desire? Should I put my arms around you? The 
Thank wow. you. Wow, yeah, Joe Giff. Yeah. So here's a story. There's this old boy in Detroit, Michigan, and he wants to learn to sing country music, and he was listening to uh, the Grand Ole Opry. And uh, if you're from Michigan or up that way, you know that sometimes it goes in and out. And you can't hear it. And sitting out in the truck when I was a little boy, I could get it out in the, tr in the truck and, and hear it. But anyway, he wanted to learn country music, and he would <clears throat> sit down and tried to write out the words, but it kept going in and out. So he said he just made up his own words. Finally, he said, I got tired of that, and I just made up the words to my own songs. And uh, he's probably one of the uh, most uh, highly respected, wrote more songs in Nashville than anybody. His name's Harlan Howard. And um, here's Harlan Howard's first uh, number one record that he wrote in uh, 19, yeah, yeah. Sounded exactly, Ed Zachary did this song. It sounds ex Ed Zachary like this. <laughs> It on the ground to pick me up on your way down. Pick me up on your way down when you're blue and all alone. When the glamour starts to bore you, come on back where you belong. You may be their pride and joy, but they'll find another toy. And they'll take away your crown. Pick me up on your way down. Oh, Dougie, down. Underneath you're still the same But when you learn these things are true I'll be waiting here for you When you tumble to the ground Pick me up on your way down Pick me up on your way down When you're blue and all alone when the glamour starts to bore you, come on back where you belong. You may be their pride and joy, but they'll find another toy. And they'll take away your crown, but pick me up on your way down. And when you tumble to the ground, pick me up on your way down. So except for Marty, because <laughs> Marty, does anybody remember the guy who had that song out? What was his name? This guy said Muhammad Ali. He was the greatest. He was the greatest. You're right, Charlie Walker, who was a uh, disc jockey and 
Dallas, Texas. How about that? You should know that. I'm a plethora of useless information, folks. But I'm stalling while Dougie uh, finds his uh, backside. Yeah. You got it? <laughs> All right, so we're going to move on. I told you we were playing a bunch of old songs, and, man, I could play that stuff all day. As a matter of fact, we talked about, most of you all know we do a thing called Friday Night Live. If you uh, watch, we've been thinking about making one of those Friday Night Live all songs like that, all real old songs. <laughs> Nobody right. that's even living anymore, <laughs> artist. Yeah, dead songs, yeah. Now, listen, I'm going to tell you something. If we, if we do this, and you guys want to do it, and I talk my boss into do it, and then you hang my ass out and don't buy tickets. <laughs> I'm not going to be very happy. We got faith in you. Y'all will show up. So maybe we'll do that. We'll make a Friday Night Live that will just do a bunch of old classic country stuff. I know tons of that stuff. So. Well, you folks uh, that like that old country music, you're in the right place. Because the Malpest brothers are here. Uh, they are absolutely unbelievable. That's what they play. And... Um, you know what? Uh, the cool thing, too, is, uh, man, they're, they're cool guys. We've been hanging out all, uh, most of the afternoon just swapping road stories and stuff we know. You know, those guys toured with Merle Haggard for like eight years. And, uh, what, man, they got what an incredible opportunity that was uh, alone. Uh, so anyway, they're, they're uh, excited. We're going to bump it up just a little bit uh, to our era <coughs> and uh, do you a song uh, that's uh, more kind of what we do. Um, uh, who let the dogs out, boys? No. No. Oh, 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 oh. Who let the dogs out? Oh. Yep. I'm sorry. It, it was me. I did it. <laughs> My sorry. friend. Uh, our friend. Our friend Marty's just looking at the floor. <laughs> I never. Come on, him. Marty. Who did that song? Uh, who did that song, Marty? Marty. Ah, yeah. oh, look at there. Marty, we got him. Marty Pants. Ha <laughs> Marty. Marty. Who did that song? I don't know. Jack, Jack Green, wasn't it? <laughs> All right, enough BS. Here's our last song. Hey, thanks a bunch of guys. God bless y'all, okay? Here we go. Like Grandma and Grandpa used to play Then I'll float on down the river To a cage and hide away Drift away like Tom Sawyer Ride a rap with old Huck Finn Take a nap like Rip and Winkle Daydream used to play Then I'll float on down the river To a cage and hide away Oh, Dave, come on, son! Just to prove that I'm a man Spend the day being lazy Just be nature's friend I'll climb a long tall hickory Bend it over skinny cats Playing baseball with shirt rocks Using sawmill slats or bats I'll play some back home come on music that comes from the heart play something with lots of feeling cause that's where music has to start oh play me some mountain music like grandma
music, oh baby. 